high ticket offers, why are they important? Guys, Kim Barrett here. I am just at uh, in Guanajuato in front of the San Diego Church and the Juarez Cinema over here. Now, I wanted to film you a quick video around why high ticket offers are important. And there's a, a myriad of reasons, right? And um, I'm going to liken it to these guys over here. We've got people selling, we've got people selling uh, corn, we've got people selling coffee, we've got people selling coke, all different things all over here. Now, first reason why it's important because a high, a high ticket offer allows you to really optimize and improve the level and profit that you make. Call it the profit maximizer. Because if someone comes in and buys one thing, you don't really make much profit off of that. The first thing that they buy, if I go and buy a can of Coke, if I go and buy a small little picture from over here, that's not really going to provide them with a ton of profit. That's not really going to provide them with what's going to you know, suffice them for the next couple of years. What is, is having a high ticket offer. So if I go and buy a small painting and then they upsell me to a big one, they upsell me to a canvas, then that is where they're going to make all of their money. Now, for you and your business, you need to think about what your high ticket offer is. And I'll get to that in a second when we look at creating it. But the reason why it's important as well is because everyone wants to do more. Everyone wants to spend more money with us. Up to 20% of the people on average want to take your next offer. So if you're just stay, staying and sticking with that one thing, at like these guys here, one picture, if I was to give them advice, it would be, cool, where's the combo packs, where's the two, three, four packages so that they can upsell and improve their profit maximization. Now, in the next couple of videos, we're gonna look at what high ticket offers are. I'm gonna show you one from inside one in Orlando, what a high ticket offer is. Um, it's because it's an event where uh, I'll be speaking at and people will pay several thousand dollars to go to stay in a house there. And I'll get, uh, ideally, I think I'll get one of the masterminds behind this, Rhonda Swan, to explain a little bit about what a high ticket offer looks like when it comes to being in a, uh, uh, a premises together, bringing people together. If you're a service provider, taking people away on retreats and things like that, I'll give you an example. And I'll also give you an example for those of you that are just predominantly online service-based businesses on how you can scale and improve your high ticket offers too. Until then, I will see you in just a second. Hey guys, so we're picking back up here on the high ticket offers. I've got Wanda Swan in the car with us. We're on the way to an event with Eric Thomas, um, which is a, is a high ticket offer in itself. However, I wanted to tell you guys a little bit, like I mentioned before, like, you know, why we should look at high ticket offers. I wanted to tell you a little bit about the types of offers that she runs so you guys can get an understanding of what they look like and how you can execute upon them. So, Rhonda, take it away. Yeah, I love high ticket offers because for me, the energy that I put in, it's either the same type of energy you get for $100 product, you get for a ten thousand dollar product, pretty much. So I love high ticket offers. But what we do is, like for instance, I just had an event. We have a, a, a course, which is a nine ninety seven course, a twelve week program, and then an event. So the event is like the ultimate kind of peak of the ascension model. So we start off at a low course, with no touch whatsoever, with a twelve week program that has more touch, uh, group sessions, and then the pinnacle for us is the high ticket, which is the event. But at the event, there's also another high ticket offer that we bring up, which pretty much stacks on everything they've done with us, but adds a lot more extra value because we bring in additional speakers like Kim. So Kim not only comes in and, and teaches our clients the work that he does, but then we tie that all together in a great bundle so that now our clients not only want to continue investing more, staying in our conversation, but they also get additional content from our speakers. And um, so that's what I love the most about is being able to layer and stack up the side to the offers. Exactly. And if someone was thinking at the moment, they're like, okay, I understand now like why they're important, what they are, how would you recommend that they start to think of crafting one for themselves if they're in the like if they're like speakers, consultants, experts, those types of people. What like is, is an event the best type of high ticket offer? That's a really good question. It pretty much depends on the person. You know, I always we stack it out and say, okay, you know, what do I want to do? How do I want my day to look like my business to look like? Do I want to work personally one-on-one -on -one with people? Or do I not want to? That's actually a pretty confronting question. You think, oh, question. I can charge 10 grand, but I really don't want to be <laughs> with a person one-on-one -on -one or in a space together at a retreat or an event. So I think that's the most important. But my best recommendation would be um, find out how you want to work with someone, if it's one-on-one -on -one or a group, and um, then just look at the structure that you want to have. Is it you know, working with someone, let's say, for 12 weeks and add on the big ultimate pinnacle peak, which is an event or a retreat, or would you prefer to do a lot more one-on-ones, 
which of course takes more of your time up, but you can also charge a higher ticket as well. Great, and what about for someone if they had, we've got an example in the car, we've got the lovely, oh, wrong way, if I move over here, Pon LA, Rockstar. What about if someone has a physical product business? Ah, well, this is awesome because this is something that they might even be able to add to, right? We're talking about higher ticket offers on the Ascension model. here are car salesmen. However, we are all at a automotive uh, conference and we're all picking up ideas from people in these industries and sharing ideas from ours that they can use as well. So thank you so much uh, ladies for sharing that and guys as always thank you for tuning on in on our YouTube channel. Make sure that you like this, make sure you comment, tell me if there's anything else that you want me to do, new content that you want to see and as always if you really like the subscribers for the children guys it's for Hanale she wants me to have lots of subscribers so and share it and share right don't 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 make the don't kids sad guys okay until next time adios guys see you soon Be